Everyone, thank you very much for your time. I'm showing our work, Deep Long, Deep Three Dimensional Dual Path Networks for Automated Pulmonary Nodule Detection and Classification. This work was mainly done when I was an intern in Baidu Research. Lung cancer is the most common cancer for death. Most diseases can get better treatment if they can be diagnosed early. Computed tomography is a good tool for accurate and early pulmonary nodule diagnosis because we can get uh, whole information for the lung compared to X-ray images. Because computed tomography is a special three-dimensional image, we consider three-dimensional convolution network is a natural choice for pulmonary nodule analysis. To reduce the number of parameters in three-dimensional convolutional network, we designed two three-dimensional dual path networks for nodule detection and classification respectively. The deep lung is the first system for automated and complete computer-aided diagnostic system for pulmonary nodule diagnosis, which gets state-of-the-art and doctor-level performance. We first designed three-dimensional fast region convolution network with UNET and uh, uh, three-dimensional dual path network for nodule detection. After that, uh, we use three-dimensional dual path network to extract the features for the detected nodule. Then we use a gradient boosting machine with the extract feature, detected nodule size, and raw pixels for nodule classification. We design three-dimensional dual path network for, to build an effective three-dimensional convolution network. Dual path network tests both advantages of DanceNet and ResNet for feature reuse and feature exploring. Dual path network gets better performance than ResNet with less parameters. We use UNET to build a fast region convolution network. For the encoder, we use 26 layers dual path network. We use 3D DPN to extract features for the detected module. Then we use a gradient boosting machine and uh, with uh, the 2,500 CT dimensional deep features and uh, detected uh, nodule diameter and raw pixels for nodule classification. We use Luna 16 uh, for nodule detection and use LIDC IDRI's uh, annotation for nodule classification. We use tenfold patient level cross validation in the experiment. The 3D DPN26 only uses one fourth the parameters as 3D RES18, but gets 1% improvement than RES18, which is better than two stage method. The classification framework uh, gets better, 3% better than previous state of the art method. The deep lung gets better performance than doctor uh, based on their individually competent nodules. For other nodules, the deep lung gets four standard deviation better than doctor. We calculated the classification performance based on detected nodules. On the true party of detection set, deep lung, gets, uh, deep lung is within doctor's uh, performance range. We also calculated the patient level diagnosis performance based on doctor individually competent, uh, competent tomographies. Deep lung is comparable with the doctor. From the visualizations, deep lung detects well for these randomly chosen nodules. In conclusion, we use a three-dimensional dual path network and uh, UNET uh, to build a three-dimensional fast RCN for nodule detection. And we use a deep 3D DPN and a graded boosting machine for nodule classification. The deep lung gets a state-of-the-art performance, which is uh, comparable with the doctor. Code is also available. Thank you very much. Welcome to our poster.